serious question. Okay. Do you think if we go and invade that bounce house, this state trooper is going to care? No. The bounce house bouncer stepped away. It's totally unattended. How can they? Dude, nice to hold this bad boy. <laughs> I'm ready. Here we go. We're here with Ryan Piscois, who just got his eyes blacked. Seriously, how the hell do we pronounce your last name? Nice and clear in the microphone. Chester. Purcell. Chester. Purcell. Chester. Yes. Some people call it that, say it like that, but not me. Not this guy. If you had the same sort of tight curl that High and Tight has, would your top knot sit higher on your head than his currently does? Absolutely. 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 Twice as high. Twice as high. Okay, legitimate question. Okay, Carlot sex match that you guys are playing today. How bad are we gonna beat them? Bad enough. Bad enough. They're a good team. They've been playing well. I think uh, it's gonna be a four quarter game. That's our expectation, but uh, we think we got the legs to take it. So uh, as long as we win, I'm happy. Hey, thanks, Percy. Thanks, guys. We'll see you, brother. Good luck. Hey, hey, what's going on? Dr. Flatball down here on the sideline. We caught up with the Charlotte Express player. What's your name? Nate Goff. Nate. Golf. Golf. Golf or golf? Golf. Golf. Nate's waiting for the bathroom. How long have you had to pee, Nate? Since we got on the bus in Dallas. That was last night. How big is your bladder? Not big enough. How do you feel about the goatee going out of style in like 1998? What do you got going on? You can absolutely. Neck beard, beard. Neck beard. Yeah, no, I'll this guy's got the same thing. Oh, someone's like struggling to get out of that restroom. Go help him, Goff. Go save him, Goff. Oh, they're really locked in. Yeah. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> Where's the key? Where's the state trooper? Get a He's crowbar. In here. The trooper's in there? Yeah. <laughs> Nate Goff, thanks for your hey, time. Hey, buddy. Pleasure to meet Good you. Good luck out there. Flatball. Yeah, we'll see it. Dr. Flatball, don't fuck it up ever again. Hey, everybody. Dr. Flatball down here on the actual sideline. I love this media badge. I can't even tell you. Uh, we're here with Brett Grauman. Just finished up, uh, what year at UMass? My sophomore year. Excellent. He's recovering a little bit from uh, Natty's, which was last weekend. Uh, do you, have you earned a nickname on the team yet? Uh, I don't have a nickname on the soul yet. Everyone at college calls me Bert. Um, me and this other guy, we kind of a Bert and Ernie duo. I don't know who my equivalent Ernie is on the soul yet. Um, no one calls me Bert here, but hopefully once I can start playing, I'll get a nickname. I mean, Carson Wilder is your Ernie, honestly. Yeah. So how do you feel about today's game? Why are you sitting out exactly? Um, I banged on my knee pretty bad against Texas A&M and Nationals, um, and then played the rest of the weekend on it, obviously, because I'm a stubborn college kid. Uh, we're expecting a pretty big V today. We expect you to do your part on the sideline. You got any sort of uh, advice you'd like to pass on to your brethren here on the soul? Just go out and play hard. Make sure you wear sunscreen. Brett, thanks, man. Thank you. Best of luck. Pleasure. We expect to see you out here in a couple weeks. Definitely. I'm here with our freaky fan of the week. Dude, what prompted the outfit this week? This is wonderful. Because back in the day, these were uniforms. We didn't have this fancy matching uniforms with names and numbers and whatnot shit. We didn't even have cleats half the time, man. So I'm just going old school. This is a uniform to me, man. He's intimidating and I don't like his values, but I like his style. And so that's what matters here in Austin, Texas. Can we get it up top and the clear shades to boot? It's our good friend Pit Boss, Freaky Fan of the Week. Yeah, we're 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 that's okay. Yeah. 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 Woo! 
design of them. Yeah, she does. Oh, those are amazing. Oh, not just any calves, very tan calves that they have. Four calves. Whoa. We're here with Dan and who are you? Dan and Sam. Flex. 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 Oh, you just like stand up on your toes. Nice. Get up on the toes. Yeah. Dang. He was in one of the first Blood movies. Don't forget that. Oh, Big Daddy, who is not a woman, but we're going to let that slide. Damn, Big Daddy. This guy knows what he's doing. We're here with Chase Cunningham, who is. Uh, You've got a lot of fine qualities. I would say your best quality is last second pucks. Um, today you didn't manage to pull one of those off. What the hell happened out there? Well, I think I just worked out a couple too many times this week. Uh, I was feeling a little weak in the arms and then given the wind, a little bit tougher to get it down there, but probably should have recovered a little bit. A little bit. Well, we expect two next time. Chase, you're notoriously, or at least in our circle, probably our biggest fan and we appreciate that. I don't know, would you call yourself our biggest fan? Uh, yeah, I think so. I've okay. listened to all your podcasts, all the video blogs. Dude, right on. Up top. Uh, uh, uh. Well, I'm here with Dr. Flatball. Uh, I got a question for you. Okay. Uh, what do you put in your hair to make it look so good? Uh, mostly just the yolks from ostrich eggs, uh, but sometimes a little bit of Johnson's No Tears baby oil. Okay, and is that, is the baby oil for the, the shine and the sleekness, or did it kind of keep it from tangling up? It's it's uh, multi-purpose. It actually, I can't believe you knew both the angles I was going for there. But the shine is, is mostly. How is it? Is the sun too much on it right no, now? It, it looks good. And like you said, I'm your biggest fan, so I've done the research. Okay? I, I know, can't I'm, prepare. I'm nervous. Chase Cunningham, thanks a lot, man. Great victory again today. Thanks. 31 to <laughs> not enough. What was your uh, nickname for these guys? Oh, the Carlot Sex Mass was one of them. <laughs> the Carlot Sex Breath. Sex Breath was a good one. All right, nice D here taking over the interview. I'm here with Chase Cunningham. And uh, Chase, I want to ask you about a moment in time. I'm not sure you remember, but I'll remember forever. It involved my brother as well, uh, Dr. or Mr. Whammo. We were playing, uh, what was that tournament? Celebration. Celebration. And someone threw you a huck. He was covering you. I saw it. You guys were about to go up. I was like, my brother needs some help. I get in there. All three of us go up. I tip it for the D. I D Chase Cunningham. Do you remember? I, I do remember it. Yeah! <laughs> yes! Yeah! Interview over. Motion from Justin, this is going live.